Well, one of the grand traditions synonymous with Virginia Tech football is, of course, enter Sandman when the Hokies take the field. But during that time, another special and more subtle tradition happens at the 30 yard line, a moment that honors our country and our military and the Corps cadets playing an important role. As the fans begin jumping to enter Sandman and the players prepare to take the field, three cadets are receiving their final instructions. 66,000 people on their feet, uh, the, the cheerleaders, the music, I mean, all the pageantry of college football is right there in that moment. So those football players coming out, you know, they're on adrenaline and they're hyped up. And so, um, yes, we want to make sure that there's a good clean handoff uh, with the cadets. It's a simple task known as flag duty but one that makes a tremendous impact. That handoff of the flags just kind of shows that connection and that tradition that goes back many, many decades. It really tied the football team and the Corps of Cadets and that, you know, what it means to be a Hokie. Um, they work hard, leadership, teamwork, selfless service, excellence. It's the same principles that they're pursuing on the football team as we're pursuing in the Corps of Cadets. The moment reserved for cadets who have earned the honor. Individual cadets chosen based on merit within the Corps. First year cadets getting the opportunity for home games, while flag duty at away games and bowl games are reserved for upperclassmen. And the select few that take the flag come away with more than a lifelong memory. I think it's really meaningful, especially like so because you see uh, uh, like kind of like a teaming up between the football team and the cadets. And like, especially before the game, you see the uh, they'll make an announcement that this is a uh, core of cadets of the year 2023 and everyone just starts cheering and that just like shows that there's a big support of the military here at Virginia Tech. 